Welcome to Leon, Nicaragua. This popular destination is known for its colonial churches, museums, and universities. But it's also one of the best cities in Nicaragua for beaches, culture, and food. From the incredible seafood and surfing in Las Peñitas to the markets in the city center, we're exploring the best that this city has to offer, especially its food. Quesillos, moronga, gallo pinto, tamales, chicha de maíz, this is Nicaragüense food at its finest, and we're exploring it all right now. Vámonos a León, Nicaragua. Buenos días, David Hoffman here from David's Bin here, coming at you from Las Peñitas, Nicaragua, a small surf town located about a 25 minute drive east of León. The reason we came here today is to have Nicaraguan seafood. Yes, I cannot wait. We're right here on the Pacific Ocean. And my man, what are we doing? We're gonna do, vamos a hacer una sopa marinera, especialísima aquí de León. You have to taste it, it's amazing. So, Las Peñitas is a beautiful town. In the beach, look the beach. Yeah, so beautiful, super wide beach. You can see lots of waves. If you go down, you can see some surfers at the very end. So, lots of waves, rocks as well. I mean, what a great place. The sun is beaming, it's only 10.30 in the morning. Let's go eat some seafood, I'm starving. It's gonna be a great day, let's go. So we're going to the boat, gold boat, or boat gold. Que venden coco, hola buenas. So she makes these like little sculptures using all the different clams, right? So she has a turtle here, she has some gallinas, so some roosters, right? She has armadillo, this is cool. Yeah. Very nice. <laughs> ¿Y cuánto, cuánto cuesta uno de las tatuas? 50 Cordoba. So when it's like a dollar fifty. So it's like a dollar fifty for, for this one, right? ¿Qué tienes ahí? Eso es una, oh, una concha, mira eso. Dos, dos dame tres, dame tres. Eh, dos cocos. ¿Tú quieres coco o no? Bueno. So we're getting three coconuts and we're getting these three for my girls. Listo. Here. Carlos. Okay. Agarra, agarra. <laughs> Para ti, ¿no? Ya, yeah, así. Muy rico. <laughs> Uno más. Amiga, muchas gracias. So, estos cocos son un poco diferentes, ¿no? Son los veo sí. más grandes. Sí, sí, sí. <laughs> no, pero tienen bastante agua. Mm. Refresh for the beach. Oh, wow, increíble. Increíble. Delicioso. A little sweet this one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y también tiene adentro. La carne. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Está carne esa. Y al final me lo cortas. Mm-hmm. Okay? They always do that, right? Amazing. So wherever you get coconuts, anywhere in the world, India, Trinidad, Miami, mm -hmm. here, they'll cut it open for you at the very end. Oh my God, it's full. Uh-huh. What a way to start a day, huh? Me lo partes. Ay, 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 mira esto. No lo terminé. Yo pensé que no me lo terminé. Mira eso. Oh man, look at that. The coconut flesh right there. It's called tender coconut in India. Oh my gosh. So I've got a piece right here. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh wow. Mm. It's so good, guys. Mm. It's sweet. So chunky, so meaty. Oh, es lo máximo. Bueno más. Así lo sientes. Mira cómo rompe eso tan rápido. Esta mujer tiene experiencia, ¿no? Sí, yo también, me lo corto. Pero increíble cómo lo saca tan rápido y después en bolsa. Todo en bolsa. Everything in bags yeah. here, en Nika. Nika style. ¿Cuánto sería por las tortugas y también los tres cocos? So almost 300, so it's like a two, 270, so that's roughly like 9 US dollars. 9 dólares. 9 dólares. Diario hay cocos. Ah, sí? Diario hay cocos. Wow. So every single day she's here because they have coconuts every day here in Las Peñitas and obviously she makes these beautiful crafts which she should definitely buy. I love this little jewelry box, you guys should see this. Look at this box. Beautiful tree. Precioso. 30, 40, 50, me falta 20. Tiene 20? Tiene 20, te pago. Okay. Gracias, amiga. Amiga, la próxima. Hasta luego, cuídate. Hasta luego, chao. Amigo. Hola. ¿Quieres coco? Guys, I cannot stop eating this tender coconut. Mm -hmm. 
Enjoy the coconut. Mm -hmm. They are amigo. amigo. It's too good. It's too good. So as you can see, this is a small town. Very, very small. It's like one strip along the beach. You have houses, you have a few vendors, some people selling the same thing, right? So like more clammed artisanal uh, little crafts, right? And then you have restaurants, you have some hotels here as well, some hostels, um, and that's basically it, right? So we're going to the very end, to the gold boat or golden boat, uh -huh. and then we're gonna have a bunch of seafood. Oh, wow, mira eso. Eso es como un transporte, eso como un taxi. Wow. Un triciclo. This place is awesome. And here we go, Barca de Oro, right here. This yellow building. Let's do it, I'm hungry. Con mucha hambre. David, un placer. Encantado, como estas? And this is Barca de Oro, so it's a hostel and it's also a restaurant. So you can see, this is it. Beautiful, right here on the water. They have a few fishermen right in front of us, some boats, and you have these uh, so little terrace and then all dining area, right? Yes, exactly. This is a beautiful place, especially for tourists, for people that uh, make uh, surf. Yeah. So we're going to have a good time. And uh, la sopa levanta muerto, you're going to love it. Let's do it. Live let's it. do yeah, it. Let's do it. Come on. Let's go. I need that soup right now. <laughs> I didn't have breakfast yet. That tender coconut was my breakfast. <laughs> All right, let's go inside. Listo. Listo lo que se lo que en sí lleva la sopa de camarones, almejas, langosta y huicho. Este es el pescado especial para lo que es la sopa. A pelar el chayote. El chayote. So this chayote is like a squash, right? Similar, very similar. Yeah, so right there we have some carrots. Es que tengo mucha hambre. Okay. Unas papas. So potatoes. Always potatoes. Potatoes, carrots, and a few different peppers. Wow, esto va a ser una sopa grande, ¿no? Cebolla, so that's onion, guys. Look at that. Super plump tomatoes. Mmm, me encanta. Chiltomo. Chiltomo. Pero son picantes. No, no, no. It's just like a red pepper and a green pepper. Not, not spicy at all. So, garlic. Butter. Mm -hmm. Some nice butter right there. Okay, so it's gonna light the fire. Woo! You got to meter todo ahora. So first all the vegetables, all these, right? Bien. So we're gonna wait a few minutes till this starts boiling. Once it's boiling, she's gonna add all the seafood, right? So we have lobster, we have shrimp, we have fish, and then we also have some small clams, little clams though, really beautiful, love it. Oh, it's gonna be so good. This is gonna be an amazing soup. This is gonna light you up and wake you up from death. That's what he says. <laughs> yes. So, what are we doing here? So, we're doing a cocktail. Un cocktail de qué? De camarón? Concha. De concha. Oh, wow. So, we're doing black, black clams cocktail. Yes, exactly. Perfect. So this is with onions, tomato, and then over here we have the clams, right? So it's, it's almost like squid ink right there. So they're all diced. So onions diced and tomatoes diced. For this cocktail. It's the mask como un ceviche, no? Sí. Un cocktail. So they call it cocktail, but it's more like a ceviche. Right there we have the clams. Oh, wow. In su tinta. Yeah, I mean, it's basically the same as a ceviche, right? So it's a black clam ceviche with onions, tomatoes, and lots of lime. Oh, okay, this... So she's putting all the fish in. So she's opening up the lobster. That's the lobster tail. Beautiful. Mira eso. Que rico eso. These are the shrimp. Camarones. Mmm, mira esa sopa. Se ve delicioso. Las almejas. So eso es como... Al, ah, eso, eso, almejas. Okay, so that's like a... That's clams. Mm -hmm. Vamos a mezclar. Mm -hmm. Mezcla, mezcla. La mantequilla. El consumé. Mm -hmm. La 
ahora le vamos a echar la hierba buena. La hierba buena. Hierba buena. Sí, hierba buena. Looks more like mint, right? Yeah. It's, it's mint. Like mint sí. Hierba buena. So when she says hierba buena, hierba buena, I'm thinking different story. <laughs> <laughs> por, por mojitos. Sí, sí. Nueve. Nueve. Sí. So here we're doing something very special. This is tostones with camarón. So they're frying the plantains and they smash them. They make them super thin and they put shrimp on top, right? Mm-hmm. And right there is our ceviche, clam ceviche. Ooh, mira esa langosta. La langosta. Ay, qué rico. Wow, the soup looks amazing. De verdad se ve increíble. Ya están listos. Sí. So the plantains are ready. So right there, she's smashing the plantains, flattening them. No. So now the plantains are ready, she mashed them, she flattened them, that's tostones, right? And now they're gonna cook the camarones, so the shrimp, and then after that, they're gonna put it on top, and then we're gonna have a little tosta, or a little sandwich, right? Like shrimp and tostones. ¿Qué le vas a echar ahora? Pimienta, poquito de pimienta, un poquito de consomé, un poquito de consomé. So consomé and pepper. Wow, the aroma coming out of that pan is unreal. Nice succulent shrimp, got that pepper. Pepper just pops, black gold, so good. ¿Qué es eso? Pico de gallo. Pico de gallo, so this is like a tomato salsa. So, it, so there's onions, there's red pepper, green pepper, and it's tomato. Pico de gallo. Pico de gallo. ¿Has otra vez? Sí. Ah, I didn't know that. Wow. So she's frying it for a second time. First time, the plantain, and then they smashed it, and now they fry it smashed. Yeah, listo. Sí. That was like one minute listo. to make those. So, ¿cómo se hace? Okay. So you put the pico de gallo there. So that's what they're using as like the base, right? Sauce base. Oh, okay, así. Esto va a ser increíble. Y ahora? Ahora vamos a poner los palillos. Ah, palillo. Sí. Yeah, toothpicks. So they use toothpicks. They puncture a hole right through the shrimp and they connect it to the toston. Ah, me diste más. Gracias, amiga. Es que tengo mucho hambre, so I need more shrimp. What is it? Crema. So this is cream, huh? Yeah. Es como crema sour cream or? Yeah. Sí. Oh, wow. 100% Mira cómo se quema, ¿no? Se derrite. Mmm, the cream. That smells amazing, the aroma. Se le echan los huichos primero. Los huichos, so first the, the fish. El pescado. Mm -hmm. Luego la langosta. Wow, esa langosta se ve espectacular. Los vegetales. Una sopa enorme, ¿eh? Como esto es para tres personas. La sopa está lista. Esta sopa se ve increíble. Tortilla. And here we have our seafood feast, the Levanta Muerto, right? So the sopa marinera, so lobster, clams, shrimp, fish. It looks amazing. Next to it we have the black clam ceviche. Incredible, can't wait for that. And over here, the tostones with camarón. So shrimp and tostones. Looks amazing. I'm ready. Amiga, gracias. Muy amable. También. Okay, vamos a comer. Vamos. All right, so we're thinking to eat right here, right on the beach. Yeah. I think it's nice. Como esa. Okay, esto levanta muertos. Levanta muerto. <laughs> I don't have a hangover. I'm good. I'm good. I'm excited though. This is, looks amazing. Look at this. Huge lobster. We have the fish. We have these beautiful little clams. That's like clam. Yeah. The clams are gorgeous. Look, so it's different, no? Look at that beautiful little clam. I'm just gonna try one of these tiny clams. Uh -huh. tal? Good. Delicioso. <laughs> Delicioso. Okay, vamos a empezar, no? Okay. So we have super nice soup. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, wow. Chile. That's like everything in there. Oh, Chile. Chile, yeah. This has literally the flavors of the sea right here. Mmm. Yeah. Delicioso. Delicioso. Muy rico esto. Wow. Oh, Chile? Mm -hmm. Mira, dame lo aquí. Okay. So I'm gonna get a little bit of the um, tomato, chili, 
Here, have some shrimp head. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, that's good. Yeah. Mm. So that one has carrots, so it's an mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um Cucumber mm -hmm. and chili, jalapeño. The jalapeño. Yeah, that's yeah, so what I was going to say. It's a little spicier, but it's very rico. Riquísimo. Te quiero felicitar por tu español. Sí, ¿no? Mmm. Mm. Mm. Y me tiene un poco de ese crema. La crema. Y como de da como un poco más de... Un poco más dulce. Como Exacto. un poco, ¿no? Exacto. ¿Por qué? So, a little sweeter. Let's grab one of these shrimp. Yeah. Let's get in here. Grab a beautiful shrimp. And this one has all the cascara, ¿no? Uh-huh. So the shelling. So you got to rip it out. Just got to take it apart. Yeah, I mean, that's... They say that it gives you more flavor, right? Si lo tienes. And you never take off the tail until it's done. Yes, sir. Like that. Take off all the little legs. Pull out this. Mm. It's good. Mm. It's so good. <laughs> oh, guys, I love shrimp. Yeah, it's phenomenal, too. actually. Me too. Wow, so fresh. That's the thing, it's right? Fresh We're right here. You have the ocean in front of you. Mm -hmm. It's a complete meal right here. Si, tiene todo. Todas las verduras. For me, this is the best type of soup, right? I'm super, super healthy. Pulling out the clam. Mm -hmm. mm. I love it because we saw the whole process, right? Oh, How it works. Lobster. So let me just grab this lobster, rip it open, right? Como la. Oh, wow. A la matasa. Pero mira, aquí lo agarras. You're supposed to get in here, grab all the meat. Wow. Two? Okay. Look at this beautiful lobster. So much meat. ¿Y cómo se llama esta langosta? Esta no es un spiny. Mmm, langosta. The same. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. So buttery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Lobster is my favorite thing on earth. Mm. Oh. O sea que yo soy de Miami. Mm -hmm. En Miami tenemos langosta season, ¿no? Como hay parte del año que puedes agarrar. El resto is frozen. So it's only, you know, we have seasons. And that's when you get the freshest lobster. If not, it's just frozen. What, in qué fecha? Eh, agosto, creo. Mm -hmm. Sí. Yeah. Como agosto, como hay una semana. Mm. At the end, you just like... Aquí todo el año. Aquí todo el año? Mm -hmm. Wow. Todo el año. Tenemos langosta. Pero aquí no lo comen de más. Como no... Hay. Hay mucho, no? Hay that's the problem, sí. is that in Miami, ya... Ya no casi hay. Really? Yeah, we overfish, you know? Mm -hmm. That's called the world, you know? Mm. And that's it for the langosta. I think that's going to get into this fish, right? The fish, yeah. ¿Cómo hacemos con el pescado? Pescado. ¿Cómo haces? Tienes que agarrarlo aquí. Okay. Y quitarle la carnita. Ah, sí. Sí. Pero aguantarlo. Sí, sí, yo sé. Okay. So you always have to go like that, front to back. Oh, okay, perfect. Me agarra ese pedacito. Woo! Oh my God. <laughs> Super buttery fish. Yeah. Oh, snap. That is so good. Yeah. yeah, just be careful the spine, right? Yeah, yeah. I'm so careful. I mean, look at this, man. You have beautiful sand right there. It looks like dunes, right? Mm -hmm. Because we're here like in the middle of a, like a little inlet, right? Mm -hmm. You have the boats. We're here a few restaurants. And then we have this. You can walk on the town. You can see the surfers. The surfers. Yeah, it's good. La Peñita is one of the most mm. beautiful beaches in Nicaragua. Some of the best food I think mm -hmm. I've ever had in my life. And the food too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. The food, very important. I mean, I'm a big seafood guy. Mm -hmm. Some places I've been to on coast mm -hmm. don't have good seafood. Yes. Depends lugar. Mm -hmm. Depends en qué usan, no? Mm -hmm. Y qué fresco es. And just go in here and get the meat. Mm -hmm. Quieres? Casi no comes. <laughs> Pero hay más, no? Vamos a probar el, los, las papas. All right, so let's finish the soup because we still have two more dishes. But I have to get in here and just get some more of the actual soup, the broth. Mm, that broth mixed with the cream. Mm -hmm. Oh, because she literally threw the broth. Sorry. So she put the, the cream mm -hmm. and then she added the broth and like literally melted the cream. Yeah. And then, the other. See you. Otro sabor. Wow. Esto es lo máximo. Guys, let's get in here and pull this apart. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. I love it. 
I can be in here all day. Literally, I can be in here all day like this. I think now we should move on to okay. the cocktail. Yeah, so this is the cocktail, right? So this is like almost a ceviche. So it's black clams black with uh, diced onion, diced tomato. Uh -huh. So they gave us some crackers. Uh -huh. You can put them on the cracker or straight, right? Mm. Well, because I want. Mmm. Mmm. It's so good. Yeah. I'm fresh, no? How Nicaraguan people eat this? Show me. You put here. Mm -hmm. Put here and. Mm -hmm. I see. Do it, do it. So put it right on the cracker, right? Just yeah. stack it. Just like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, these clams. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alive. Mm -hmm. Alive. I mean, it's a great contrast, right? <laughs> so it's super limey, mm -hmm. crunchy. Crunchy. Is you have the sea there mm -hmm. with the clam, and you have a nice base, a nice cracker, right? Oh, nice crunch. Changes it all, everything, the flavor, you know? Ah, chili. We forget the chili. Mmm. Mmm. You put so much lime in here. I love it. <laughs> ah, listo para esto? Listo. Okay, so what's the secret here? Uh-huh. Ponele el... Secret, sí. Tienes que ponerle the sauce. Okay. Así. Mm-hmm. So you're going to add the um, pico de gallo. Pico Abre, de gallo. Quitamos. Es más una salsita del pico de gallo. Okay, yeah. So it's more like a salsa, right? Mm -hmm. Tostones are nice. They're not too hard. Mm -hmm. Do you know? Wow, let's do it together. Let's do it together. Okay, okay. I am so excited for this, my man. Okay. Hey. Cheers. Cheers, vamos. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh man. Very good. Very good. Love it. The plantain is it's not too hard. Mm -hmm. Nice and like soft, a little crunch in the outer layer. Mm -hmm. And you have the pico de gallo, which is basically a pure tomato onion salsa. Mm -hmm. And you have the nice shrimp, right? Super fresh from right here. Mm -hmm. Everything here was incredible. Mm-hmm. Mm. I think the secret is that lot is fresh. That's fresh. fresh. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if it's ever frozen, mm -hmm. it would never taste the same. No, it's the same. <laughs> so good. The only problem is the plantains really fill you up. Mm -hmm. You know, what's amazing is that while we're here, the fishermen keep walking by. They're yeah. singing us so like, yeah, yeah, que bueno, que comiendo. It's like, yeah, yeah, we're eating your fresh food. <laughs> yes. oh, it's, it's so fresh. Su super fresh. Too fresh. Yeah. Lo comiste demasiado rápido. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Oh, yeah. If you want to, yeah, crazy. Aquí, I got a poco de clams, no? Mm -hmm. It's on top. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. 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 Limon. And then what we'll do is we'll finish up and we'll go around and see more of the town, right? Come. Yeah. I can't stop with this broth though. Mm -hmm. My see question it? is, are you alive now? Dude, I'm super alive. <laughs> I feel I'm great. Sure it's my first real day here uh -huh. in Nicaragua and I feel amazing. Woke up at 4.30 in the morning because of the two-hour change, but it's fine. <laughs> Thank you for love, Nicaragua. It's your second day. You're going to enjoy. I know. Have a love trip. A love trip. <laughs> I love you, dude. <laughs> You're so funny. All right, so now we're going to walk through the town. So literally, once you leave this restaurant, you make a left on the strip, and you have it. And over here, you see how it says pulperia. Pulperia. That's not really an octopus place. That's more like a small vendor. So we have hotel and restaurant Barca de Oro and the town. Let's go. Yeah, like I was telling you guys before, Pulperia is not really an octopus place. This is straight up like a little kiosk, right? They just have snacks, they have refreshments, and they have things for the house, right? So they have soap, shampoo, you know, detergent, uh, even uh, 
Manchun, so instant instant Man lunch, right? Yeah, Manchun, yeah. it's pretty cool. And then over here to the left, you have like uh, some hostels, Hostel, some yeah. some bed and breakfasts, yeah. mini restaurants as well. Yeah, yeah. Pretty nice. Remember that this town is for surfers, and many hostels in all 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 the town, many. He says avocado. So this vendor says avocados. Yes, avocado. Oh, avo no, no, it's avocados, uh, melons, and yes, lime. Melon. ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien. So qué me vendes aquí? Oh, he just walks around town selling, right? He's yeah. stopping at every All person's the, house the town, selling. Yeah. No, the Leon. The Leon. Leon. Yeah, yeah, 28. super close. 25 minutes. Yeah, exactly. I love it because she's saying, I want some for tomorrow. So he gives her one that's not ready, not ripe yet. It's still really hard. It's pretty awesome that he does that, right? <laughs> bueno, amigo, gracias. Okay. Muy amable. Lo vemos, lo vemos. Let's go. Hermano, estamos listos. Listo. So this is a beach town. You come here, you relax, you go surfing, you sleep in, you have some lunch, you surf again, you party at night. They were telling us Sua is the place you should go at night for like, if you want to drink, Sua, S-U-A. Looks pretty cool, I just saw it right there by the beach. And we're just going through the town right now. So you can see this beautiful housing on the right and the left, lots of different coloring for all these gates. You know, you have green, blue, aqua. All right, so after a 10 minute drive, we're here back at the beach. We just went around the town, Saw it, and that's basically it, right? Surf this, town. Yeah, surf town, but now we are in Poneloya. 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 Las Peñitas is there. Okay. And near Poneloya, there are beaches together. Okay, so we started right across there. Exactly. And now we're on a different beach, as you can see, look at this beach. Poneloya. Another super long, you know, dark sand beach. Gorgeous. And that's it for Las Peñitas. Beautiful surf town, you got the beach, you have the town, lots of pulperias, and we went to Barca de Oro, and we had the most amazing seafood soup of all time, Levanta Muertos. Are you alive? I'm alive, I'm alive. <laughs> yes, and I love that little you ceviche. Enjoy it, Las Dude, it's so good, so good. The food's okay. absolutely phenomenal. So we had the soup, we had the ceviche, ceviche with the black clams. The trip with plantain. With plantain, so yeah. tostas con camarón. Delicious, phenomenal. You have to go there, you have to eat there, you can stay there, and from there you can explore the town, the beaches. It's relaxed, right? Las Peñitas right next to Leon, about a 25 minute drive. So that's where we're going next. We'll see you right there, right now. Guys, if you love this video, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. We'll see you in the next travel food adventure in Nicaragua. Vamos, amigo. Vamos, 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 vamos Leon. Tengo hambre. Vamos, vamos. <laughs> oh, a surfer, finally. What's up guys, David Hoffman here from David's Bin here, coming at you from beautiful, hot Leon, Nicaragua, one of the two colonial cities of the country. It was founded in the year 1524, and as you can see, we are here in the Plaza Central. We're gonna go explore the entire city today. We're gonna see historical attractions, like behind me, we have the cathedral, right in front of us, we have lots of street food vendors. We're gonna try raspados, elotes, we're gonna see some more sights. My man. Are you ready for raspado? Raspado? Come on. So what's that? <laughs> snow cones. All right, so right here we have one of the vendors. Hola, ¿qué tal? Buenas. Dulce de leche, piña, rosera, ¿Cuál me le recomendas a él? El dulce de leche. Yeah, dulce de leche. Okay, dulce de leche. Basically, pure sugar. Okay, vamos, vamos. Wow. Mira eso. Y ahora le vamos a poner otra cosita más. Lo que tú piensas. <risa> Dámelo todo. Mira eso. Wow. Se ve delicioso. Ahí viene la grosera en miel. Grosera en miel, eso es en ¿Qué es eso? Grosera en miel. Grosera en miel. Gracias. ¿Cuánto va a ser? 25. So 25 for this. All right, so raspado de dulce leche. So basically, uh, ice, you know, uh, cut up ice. So like a snow cone, same thing, but with dulce leche. Okay, here we go. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. ¿En qué son estos? Porque, mmm. The seeds. Pero sea, son como acidita. Ah, okay. Mm-hmm. Como acidita, si pero en ácida. Ah, okay. Está riquísimo esto. Mmm. 
Y el so otro sweet. dulce de leche. Y el otro es una miel. Uh -huh. Oh my god. <laughs> y para el calor. Es demasiado delicioso. Obviamente, this is like. They also put condensed milk in here, right? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. And it's refreshing. Remember, Leon is 40 degrees. Yeah, it's 40 degrees right now. It's super mm -hmm. hot. We're having this right in front of the cathedral. Look at that behind me. Incredible. It's actually ridiculously sweet. It's like decadent as heck. Mm hmm. Here you get some of these little seeds. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Esto tiene un poco más de masa. Mm hmm. Con más carne. Mm -hmm. Porque es un dried fruit. Sí. Una cosa que ya como al final ves que estoy terminando y no hay mucho dulce de leche. Vamos para atrás. Mete más. Ok. Amiga, necesito un poco más. También lo que sea. Está muy rico esto. Delicioso. Oh, demasiado. Ahora me engordo. Eh, eso se engorda. Eso. eso se trata, ¿verdad? Oh yeah, look at that. Yeah, with this heat, it's crazy hot. Get all that ice. Mm. Oh wow. It's like a miel, no? Oh, miel. miel. ¿De qué es la miel? Un espado. Tamarindo con grosel. Es de miel de tamarindo. So it's tamarind honey with dulce leche, and now it's like starting to really melt. But it's perfect because it's how you refresh yourself, right? You just drink it here. <laughs> Delicioso. Oh, so sweet. Mm. Si yo vivo en León, como uno de estos todos los días. Just ice, man. Just ice. I'll finish it, right? Mm. Demasiado rico. ¿Tú puedes comer uno de estos todos los días? Sí, todos los sí, días, por ¿no? Por supuesto, claro. Mm. Ahora Riquísimo. todo es todo dulce leche. Demasiado. <laughs> It's one of the sweetest things I've ever had. Siempre que vengas a León, tenés que buscar un raspado. Mm -hmm. Inevitable. Yeah. El calor es... El calor es absurdo. <laughs> absurdo. And we're not even in summer yet. Y sí. Estamos en abril. <laughs> wow. Un buen raspado. Y ahora buena, te quedó buena. Wow, ¿es más dulce leche? Sí. Siempre. Mm -hmm. Sí, ese es mucho mejor que el mío. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta try this. This is bread. <laughs> so it's ice, dulce leche, and bread. Mm -hmm. mm. Más rico. Mucho más rico. <laughs> I mean, this is like a pastry. <laughs> what? Delicioso. You say what? Quitar tuyo. No, no, it's too good. <laughs> Un poco más. Mmm, it's the mejor. Get it with the bread. The bread's awesome. Wow. Más ahí. Ya eso. Que mi hombre. Sí, sí, llévatelo, llévatelo. Ya ya mal. He's like, hey, give me my food. Gracias, gracias. Muy amable. Chao. So good. Yes. Oh, y aquí qué es? A las palomas. A las palomas. Una. De una. Córdoba. De Córdoba y le va a dar a la paloma. Se toma una foto con ella. Y el pesito, ¿verdad? Ok, ok, ok. I'll do it, I'll do it. Okay, no. Vamos a ir a ver la gigantona. ¿La gigantona? La gigantona. Ya vas a ver qué cosa es la gigantona. Wow. Ay, pero me encanta esto. Mira, este cabeza. Mira, esto es increíble. Este, este es el nano, el nano cabezón y la gigantona. ¿El nano cabezón? Sí. So, little kid, huge uh, head. Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> It's amazing. <laughs> awesome. So, muchas de estas cosas son artesanales de acá. De León. No, de León. Este es súper leonés. Okay. Siempre en diciembre hay fiestas con la gigantona. Y su compañero el enano cabezón. So es la gigantona, ¿verdad? Right? Sí. So they have three different sizes here. Siempre andan por las calles de León y los ve, y las ve bailando y la y la gente les da dinero porque bailan en las calles. Dulces Estos... típicos. Dulces típicos. Dulces típicos para la gritería. Gritarías le cantan a la Virgen María todos los días. Yeah, so that they they scream or they pray to the Virgin Mary Exacto. all of December. Sí. Una pregunta, ¿el miel de dónde es? ¿De esta zona? Obvio, ¿no? ¿De dónde está el miel? Trujillo. Sí. Ok, ok. So, this is a local one from a place called Trujillo, and uh, this is 
So the real bee honey. Looks nice with the comb inside. Honeycomb. Delicioso esto. ¿Cuánto vale cada uno? 200. 200. It's not bad. I think it's like seven dollars US. There's so many sweets. This is eh, eh, coco, no? Coco. coco, coco. Yeah, so that's coconut. Estos son caramelo. The caramelos. I mean, there's too many things here. <laughs> Wait. Me llevo este. Me lo, lo como aquí. Aquí lo voy a comer ya. Yeah. Rápido. Mmm, mira eso. It's nice and dense. Oh. Mmm. Increíble. Mmm. -hmm. Mmm. Super soft, actually. Crumbly. Mmm. It's like fruity. It's like the so the meat of the pear, but then it has this like nice layer on top. Obviously, lots of sugar in here. Mmm. You have to try this cookie of sapoto. Sapoto. <laughs> <laughs> Mil gracias, gracias por todo, delicioso. Gracias. Zapote. Zapote. This is the calabash. You can drink a shot of flor de caña here. Super easy. Look. Y aquí tenemos. This is calabash, pero it's like a glass for drink chicha or tiste or other uh, traditional uh, drink. Okay, so all these are made from the calabash, ah, calabash seed, right? So she designs them all. Look at this. Beautiful. Love the design. So she like literally just chiseled her way through this whole thing. Really nice. And then she's saying that you can get this and you have the chicha with this, right? The chicha drink? Chicha or, with this. Soup or soup. Yeah, like this. That's amazing. Yeah. That's crazy. ¿Y cuánto vale cada uno de estos? ¿O cuánto vale como un set? Todo vale 100 ese. Five dollars. Cien, no, tres y medio. Tres y medio. Sí, sí, sí. All right, so I just bought these two, right? So this is a beer mug. It's pretty amazing. Love it. Wrote the year right here, 2022. And then this is a calabash cup, right? So I'm gonna clean it, and then from here I'm gonna walk right to this lady right here and have the chi chi chicha. Chicha. Right? Chicha. Chicha. Okay, we'll try yeah. the chicha. All right, so I'm gonna clean it. <laughs> so gotta clean it, right? So it's been sitting there. So I make sure it's really clean. A la chicha. El vuelto. Gracias, gracias, amiga. Gracias. Muy amable. Uh, 260. So that was 200 and this was 60. Okay. Amiga. Buenas. Chicha. All right. So the chicha is a corn drink and she doesn't have them in these vats right now. She has them in here, right? So this is just presentation. Okay. Con poco de hielo. Esta es la chicha de maíz negrito, 100% natural. Buenísimo. La chicha leonesa. <laughs> La mejor de Leonesa. I know, it's Leonesa, <laughs> like Lionel Messi. Ya me le está cambiando. Yeah. Sí, no, 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 está bien, está bien. Okay, my friend, ready for your chicha. Okay, voy a probar la chicha. Ay, tan rico. Refrescante. Oh my God, it's so good. So refreshing. It's amazing. You have these huge particles of corn just like throughout the whole thing. This one's black corn. Mmm, so good. Sweet, no alcohol in here, just pure corn. El sol y me levanté a las cuatro y media porque en Miami es seis y media. Locura. Gracias, amiga. Muy amable. We're going to the Cathedral of Leon. Amazing, biggest in Latin America. Is it? Yes. So it's the biggest cathedral in Latin America. This is it right here. We're going to the top. Wow. So the yeah, oldest Latin cathedral in Latin America, right here. Yeah. Latin America, yeah. no yeah. Central America, yeah. Latin America. Latin America. Oh, yes. Okay, my friend David, this basilica is very important in Nicaragua and Latin America. Ruben Darío is one of the most important poets in Latin America, and he rests here. And also, 7 of December, celebrate Leon a la Vir Maria Virgin. The cathedral has been renovated, as you can see, completely white beautiful statues around the entire cathedral we have huge paintings showing you the crucifixion of Jesus Christ over there him walking with the cross getting whipped and over here we have the final the finale when he passes and then they take him down and then it's over right so that's it that's the cathedral gorgeous now we're going to the top right yeah. let's go up all right let's go up to the top it's gonna be great wow Pretadísimo. Sí, el gordo no alcanza. El gordo no alcanza. No alcanza el gordo. If you're wider than this, you can't fit. This is nuts. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's a lot of extra.
exercise. So it's dull. That's quick. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. As soon as you make it up, over here to the right we have all the bells. Look at this. Like 50 bells. You have a beautiful view. A little hard though because you have a lot of space and obviously you cannot get on top of here. But there you have it. The central park. And over here you can walk around the whole top. Look at this. It's incredible. So you cannot get on these little domes, right? Don't stand on them. That can fall. Only here. Wow. Volcanoes. This is the city, Leon, Leon Life. <laughs> and you see the volcano, Momotombo, and you can see Cerro Negro, San Cristobal. These all volcanoes around Leon. This is amazing, dude. Yeah, I mean, this is incredible, right? So we have multiple volcanoes over there, over here as well. Uh -huh. Beautiful churches. And as you can see, Leon is a, is a very colonial city. You know, one story and then the top, you have these beautiful rooftops, right? Uh -huh. Really colorful. And then right in the center, you have this cathedral. Look at this. Wow. Beautiful. And you can see the Leon life. People on the street. This is the city of university student in Nicaragua. Many young people come to the other department to study here. And you see all the people, all the time on the street. All right, so now we're going to the very, very top. The last level. And we have to take our shoes off up here. Okay. <laughs> Listo. Wow. It's like a white wonderland here, guys. From this side, you can't really see the Plaza Central. It's a really hard view to see. Over here, we can see more, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is so nice though. Look at this. I love the white. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Incredible. So big. Huge cathedral. Massive, massive roof. Wow, aquí se ve bien ahí? La vista. Similar view like the bottom, just a little higher, right? More elevated. Over here we have more of like the forest, you know, mountains over there, volcanoes, more cathedral. I mean, here you get a real bird's eye view of what is Leon. Beautiful. And now we're gonna go back down to the, the Plaza Central and we're gonna have some elotes, crazy elotes. elotes yeah, crazy elotes. Crazy elotes. <laughs> I love it. Corn on a cob. <laughs> Today is a hot day. Está demasiado. 40 grados en León. Okay, bajamos. All right, we made it out of there really fast. And right here we have the crazy corn on the cobs. Elotes locos. Mantequilla, crema y queso. Con, con todo y tajín, no? Dale. Let's do it. Wow. So get it. So. Mantequilla. Oh, mantequilla. Okay, okay. So it's Crema. butter, cream. Nice. Wow. Así está. Se ve riquísimo eso. Queso chea. Barbecue. A todo. ¿Te va a echar todo? No. Ranch. No. Lo que él piensa, lo que tú piensas. Chile. Sí, Chile sí. Poco. Mucho, 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 mucho. No lo son. Pero da chili. ¿Tajín? Sí. Que no está bien así. Está loaded. Se ve picante. Wow. The masoca just means it's the full thing. And it's loaded. Wow. All different cheeses. Mmm, butter, barbecue. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's delicious. Mmm, it's so creamy. Mmm, the cheese here. Oh, está buenísimo. Y no tan picante. No tan. Mm hmm. Wow, it's a meal. So it's like a dollar, dollar thirty. Oh, wow. Look, below me we have all the pigeons. Hey! This is too good. So freaking cheesy. Mm-hmm. Mmm. That corn. Oh, corn on the cob. All day. You know, here in Latin America, they love this. In Ecuador, same thing. They love this. Oh, yeah. Oh no, dude, I can't stop with it. <laughs> mm -hmm. Delicious. Yeah, done. Walking around this plaza, 
you'll see lots of artisanal goods, right? So like souvenirs and stuff. I was gonna see if they had one of the jerseys of Nicaragua. Tienen, tienen aquí? Sí, de Nicaragua. Pero ese, ese es béisbol, no es de fútbol. De fútbol, tú quieres, no. ¿Cuál es ese? Número 10. Nada más bandera. ¿Cuánto vale cada, cada uno de esos? Esta es 150. Esta vale 300. Alright, so I'm gonna try this bandera, so the flag of Nicaragua. I love the blues. Right, so unfortunately they don't have the jersey. Me engordé, ya. Dos días me engordé. Gallo Pinto. Ese Gallo Pinto, no la fritanga. Pachancho con yuca. ¿Y este es M o L? ¿Esto me cabe? Puede ser. No, está mal. Está mal. Yo la veo bien. ¿Cómo te la sentí? No, como algo tan mal. Diciendo que está al revés. No, así es. ¿Sí? Pero ¿cómo te la sentí? ¿Tienes un talla más o no? ¿No te llamas? Sí, para ver. I mean, it feels a little tight. ¿Cómo está? Aquí me siento muy apretado. Like, I, I like it, pero se siente, se siente un poco extraño aquí. No, solo aquí, ¿no? Yeah, so unfortunately, I didn't get the jersey I wanted, so I passed. But here they have a lot of different things, lots of crafts, so many different crafts. I mean, so many. I don't know, I gotta wait a little bit. I gotta wait to see because so many days left, you know, there's gonna be way more craft. Obviously you can't buy in the most expensive touristic spot. <laughs> you gotta go for the things that are more affordable. Definitely bring money, definitely help out, buy some stuff. You can't leave here without buying. I like those hats though for my daughters, the little hats. No? Yes, yes. Cool. This is the a restaurant very popular in Leon. So popular. It's if you come to Leon, you have to visit El Cesteo. El Cesteo is literally right in front of the cathedral, right in front of the elote guy. And everybody's relaxing there, hanging out. Wow, and I'm tired. <laughs> Had a long day. <laughs> long. All right, this place is amazing. Look, we're sitting right here on a terrace in front of the cathedral, in front of the square. Feels like Europe. I love it. I got yeah. Flor de Caña 25 years. This is the best Flor de Caña they got, right? 25 years old. Aged yeah. rum. All right, here we go. Cheers. Well, you're not cheers, really cheers. drinking rum, no, but no, no. it's fine. <laughs> mm. Cheers. This place is amazing because people, you can see the people walking on the street. Mm -hmm. 1953, all the people come to Leon, stay here, drink, eat. The, the food is amazing. Yeah. Sneak up food and very relaxed. Feel no, this is great. Mosfera. Plus, right now it is uh, 5 p.m. Sun is starting to set. It's getting really cool. Inside, they have a lot of photos. They have masks. Uh -huh. I mean, a lot of the history, right? Four different poets. The, photo from the poets. Yeah. yeah. So four Remember poets. Remember, I told you that Leon is a city of poets, mm -hmm. a university city, and uh, a part of the restaurant you have all the pictures of the most important poets mm -hmm. from Leon. Then right now we're getting a dessert. Can you try yeah. Different? Yeah, yeah. A dessert for <laughs> corn. A corn for dessert. You. See it. For you, <laughs> everything is corn. Okay, postre. Postre. Wow, the maíz. The maíz. Increíble. Mm -hmm. Y eso con un espresso. Un espresso. Wow. Nicaragua have amazing coffee. Yeah, amazing, amazing coffee, coffee, huh? Coffee. The best in the world. Oh wow. Mm, it's actually really good. I drink it sin azúcar. Okay. Nunca azúcar. Vamos a probar esto. Okay, let's do it. Oh my gosh, this is almost like oh, some of the Venezuelan dishes I've had before. In Latin America, corn is king. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, how is it? It's amazing. <laughs> it's like super crumbly, extremely uh -huh. sweet. Mmm, it's also cinnamon on top. Uh huh. Perfect. Wow, ¿cómo se llama ese? Torta de maíz. Eso es todo. Un pastel de maíz, sí. Eso es torta de maíz. Un cake mm. maíz. Un cake, sí. Corn cake. Very sweet, sí. Mmm. Es demasiado rico. <laughs> no, yo puedo menos todo. Incredible. The cinnamon. Mm -hmm. But also the sugar inside. Very sweet. The mix, sí. Mm -hmm. Es increíble. Like this, con un poco de vanilla. <laughs> Helado de vanilla arriba. Mm. Amazing. I know, I know. It would be a great combination, right? Yeah. 
Oh, with the coffee? I mean, this is straight up like I'm in, no sé, España. Estoy en España ahora. <laughs> España con temperatura de Centroamérica. Sí, sí, sí. Es que es delicioso. Demasiado. Mm. I feel good. Cheers. Cheers. So what do we have left? Un taco. <laughs> Un taco. A pork Cierto. taco. Uh -huh, pork tacos. All right. Ready? Go ahead. Let's go. Let's go. Hola. Bueno. Aquí tenemos los tacos. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo están? Gracias a Dios. Estamos vivos, ¿no? Sí. Así estamos. Wow. So, taco en bolsa con repollo. Solo crema. Sí, sí, no, mejor crema. Un taco suave. Ah, yo quiero eso. ¿Y cuál es este? Taco de cerdo. De cerdo. So, pork and chicken. That's what they got. Ay, ¿qué eso? Esto se le llama repucheta. Repucheta. Se ve delicioso ese. Wow. Ese es el. Ese taco se ve increíble. Ah, lo vas a freír allá. So next one he's making is chicken. Oh, looks so good. Todo eso son para mí. Sí, así es. Sí, porque son frescos. Mira eso. That's pork and cheese. And over there we have chicken. Y así son. Okay, so we're gonna have this inside on a plate. So cabbage salad. Y también la salsa, ¿no? No, crema, crema. Oh. And here we go, the lino or lion tacos. <laughs> <laughs> lion tacos, Leon. Ooh, they're hot. Yeah. Mm. Oh my God. So good. These were just fried for us. Mm -hmm. They are freaking delicious. Mmm, the inside, so soft. The but cream, the cream, and the salad. Yeah. <laughs> this is so amazing. Wow, what a delicious taco. This blows away last night. Mm-hmm. Mil veces mejor, no? Yeah, yeah. Es que el cerdo mm -hmm. es tan delicioso. Mm -hmm. Es como una masa de cerdo, multiple layers mm -hmm. dough, right? Mm-hmm. And it's more skinny. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And corn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, I need spice. Everything is corn. <laughs> Everything is corn. Mm -hmm. Wow. Esto es lo mejor. Lo máximo. Wow. <laughs> I'm in love with it. You know, I thought we were done today, but mm -hmm. we're not. We're going back to the hotel. They were mm -hmm. staying. It's a convent. Mm -hmm. It was a convent, and we're gonna have a steak for dinner. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anika steak. Anika steak. Mm. With this, we're gonna have to come here for this taco. <laughs> 5 p.m. Get here. Eat on the street. Con mm huh? -hmm. Or come right inside and eat just like us, right? Yeah. And this cabbage with the cream. Oh, the cream is delicious. Nagarote, huh? Tomorrow we're gonna eat quesillos. Quesillos. <laughs> what a great taco. I would have had two or three. Each taco costs 40 Cordoba, which is around $1.20. Pretty good deal. Demasiado rico. Gracias. The sun has set. It is 6.15. We're here at my hotel, El Convento. So this was a convent. We're gonna have some dinner. Some meat. Nica meat. Listo, vamos, vamos. ¿Qué tal, cómo están? ¿Todo bien? ¿Qué estamos haciendo aquí? Todo. <laughs> Fritanga, no. <laughs> okay, so vamos a hacer carne, no? Sí. Chicken with cheese on top. Wow. Mira eso. ¿Qué tienes? ¿Cuáles son de Nicaragua? Victoria. Doña Tai. Doña Regular. ¿Y cuál es más fuerte? Ah, Toña. Sí, más fuerte. Y más, eh, la mejor. <laughs> Probamos. Okay. Nice. So I'm gonna try Tonya. This is the beer of Nicaragua. It's been a long day. I'm gonna cool myself down with some Tonya. The best beer ever. Mmm. You know, it's like 
feels like, you know, how every country has their beer, right? In terms of it's super light, made for hot weather. But this one's really tasty. And I gotta say, with the sweat coming down my body today, this will cool you down, especially in the heat. ¿Qué pedazo es? Este es filete. Está con una marinada criolla. Si la marinada va a base de vegetales, cebolla, tomo, agrio. Luego va a macera y luego va a marcar el gris. Abajo con la salsa. Sí. This is the sauce they always use for the carnes asadas, so the grilled meats. So here she started the gallo pinto. So we started with onions, so diced onions and diced green pepper. Next, they're gonna add the rice, the red beans, and also the, the cabbage, right? See, we're gonna let the gallo pinto sit here for a little bit so it dries out. Yeah. just made like a red cabbage with the toston, right? And you also have the gallo pinto, and then next to it you have like a little salsa, right? So tomato, onion, always, right? And then over here she's adding some more sauce to the meat. Wow, es que huele increíble. Listo, I am ready to eat, this is gonna be amazing. We have the amazing Amen. steak. Yes, Carne amazing asada. steak, Nika. Steak Nica. We have amazing meat in Nicaragua. This looks phenomenal. The best in Central America. You know what I love about it? Uh-huh. It's a salsa. La salsita. La salsita. Criolla. Criolla. Así. Y eso vamos a empezar plano así, ¿no? So, mm. we're gonna taste. It's so good. Let's go. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. 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 Love this meat. Super, oh, it's super soft. smoky. Mm -hmm. Love it. Soft. I miss you gotta mix it with some of the gallo pinto, right? Mm -hmm. That's the thing about down here in Central America. We mix, right? Mm -hmm. Es como no es mal mezclar. Podemos mezclar siempre. Puedes mezclar siempre si es colores, sabores. Mm -hmm. Gallo pinto. Todo Red sí. cabbage, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's a little Exacto. different. Y pico de gallo. Mm -hmm. Gallo sí. pinto. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh, this meat's amazing. It's different. Uh, this meat is different like other meat that you eat on the street. The mm -hmm. flavor because it's mm, have taste different. I mean, yo pienso que la salsa, no? Mm -hmm. La Como salsa. La salsa más el el pico de gallo es increíble. Mm -hmm. It's like a nice little salsa. Mm -hmm. Just add on top like that. It's perfect. Pico yeah, I gotta tell you guys, mm. this was an old convent, mm -hmm. right? So sort of old convent, they converted it into a hotel. Yeah. The 32 rooms, mm -hmm. a pool, restaurant, bar, mm -hmm. and in the middle you have this incredible courtyard. I mean, I got here really late, so I saw it just setting, mm -hmm. but tomorrow in the morning I'll see it really early, sun rising, it's gonna look amazing. And I, they with also- With your coffee. Yeah, with your coffee, mm -hmm. just relax, hang out here. And they also gave me some flor de caña, right? This is 25 years, so I had, Two, well, I had a shot earlier. This is like a big guy. But you know, I'm relaxing. It's 7.15 at night. And that was our day here in Leon. A long day. Long day. <laughs> Super hot day. We did so many things. We went to the Plaza Central. And there we had... Elotes Locos. Mm -hmm. Raspado. Mm -hmm. We went to the rooftop of the cathedral. Amazing. Amazing. Uh, the you restaurant. Drink, yeah, the restaurant El Cesteo. You mm -hmm. drink chicha. Chicha. You ate tacos. Amazing tacos. Probably <laughs> amazing. my favorite tacos outside of Mexico. That spot. <laughs> yeah, so amazing. good. And finally, and finally we're in here. El convento, oh, we're eating. We're eating amazing meat. Amazing meat. meat. With yes. gallo pinto, this true traditional style. With here the plantains. Mm. Mm. So much flavor. And that's it, my friends. I hope you enjoyed this video in Leon. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. And we'll see you tomorrow at the Leon Market. Yes, Leon Market. The whole market. morning in the market. Are you excited? Dude, I'm super excited. I love markets. Markets are the best. <laughs> yes, the best. But this meat, it's the best right now. Yeah.
everyone. I hope you're all doing well. This is David Hoffman from David's Bin here, coming at you from beautiful Leon, Nicaragua. Today I'm super excited because I'm taking you to explore the central market of Leon, which is right behind me. This place is amazing. They have clothing, they have food, they have vegetables. You name it, they got it. My man, are you ready? Are you ready for this cover? The market. Vamos. Come on. And so this is it, right? Mercado Central Raul Cabezas. Then to the market. Woo, look at this, flowers, vegetables. Oh, the smell in here is amazing. Smell of food. Hola, buenas. You have mangoes, you have mandarinas, potatoes, onions, papaya. Papaya. Latin America, amazing. Oh, mira aquí, star fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love a star fruit. You can do a very good drink with this. Oh yeah, drink? Yes, yeah, drink. And oh. with rum is good. <laughs> yeah, because the star fruit is very sour, yeah, very exactly. sour fruit. Over here they have some green peppers, red peppers, they got lettuce, bananas, they have yuca or cassava, right, right here? Cassava. Cassava. So root vegetable. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. So this whole section is all vegetables and fruits, right? Todo esto. Wow, look at the pineapples. Oh, that looks good. Do you like pineapple? Oh, I love pineapple. I love it. Amazing pineapples. Really good in Latin America, in Nicaragua. We have a great pineapple. It's really early in the morning, 7.30 a.m. to be exact. As you can see, in the middle, everybody's starting, you know, to put all their fruits and vegetables out, right? Wow, se ve increíble esto. Look at this. Un chile. Eso pica. Pica. ¿Puedo probar uno? Sí. Líbeme uno. Lo voy a comer. ¿Quieres uno? Sí, vamos a comer uno. Listo. Sí. ¿Cuál? Tú me dices. Sí, ese, ese. Pero pica ese. Sí. Seguro. Pica. Pica. Pues está bien. Oh, it's nice. Not too hot. Está bueno, está bueno. Mira. Oh, está buenísimo. Está rico. Wow. Pica, pica. That is hot. ¿Qué tienes ahí? Tengo ensalada de frutas. ¿Ensalada de frutas? Yeah. No era tan mal, no era no, tan mal. Sí. Picó un poco. Mmm. <laughs> nice fruit salad. You have pineapples, oh, wow. banana, mm -hmm. watermelon. Good. Let's do it. Yeah, now I'm gonna... Oh, man, that's refreshing. Mm -hmm. Oh, so good. So we have pineapple. Pineapple, banana, watermelon. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Papaya. Mmm. It's coming the heat down. Mm -hmm. Wow, it got to my head. Uh, I, I'm thinking in you after the chili. <laughs> I mean, spring. you know, it's not only the chili. It is so hot right now. Yes. Leon is on fire. Yes. Mmm. <laughs> it's so refreshing. Oh, nice. Nice fruit cocktail. So this lady has fruit cocktail, but she also has drinks, right? Yeah, yeah, all fresh. La cebada. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué tiene? ¿Qué fresco tiene? Cebada, ensalada, zanahoria, cacao. Y cacao. Y cacao, canela. Buenísimo. Martina, ¿vas a tomar eso? No, I gotta try it. Oh my god, it's amazing. Oh, it's pure cacao. So chocolatey. Like it nice and foamy. You also put cinnamon on top. Mmm, nice and sweet. Increíble. Bueno, sí, 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 me encantó. ¿Y cuánto cuesta eso? So it costs one dollar, thirty Cordoba. Sopa de leche? I mean, it looks like un tres leche. Sí, sopa de leche. Sopa de leche. Sopa de leche. So soup of milk. The sopa de leche. It looks like flan in terms of texture. Ooh, it's still super hot. Caliente. Oh, yes. Mmm. Oh, it's so good. So soft. It crumbles. Mmm. And so hay huevo aquí, seguro. Right, so it's egg, mm, this is cream, and then it's milk. That's basically it, right? It's como un flan, casi lo mismo. Mm -hmm. Corn. Oh, it's so good, so good. 
for breakfast. Gotta try this on the banana leaf. Wow. All right, let's eat together. Vamos. Es muy rico, muy caliente. Mm. Mm -hmm. Straight out of the oven. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh, it's like a plum. Dude, it falls apart in your mouth, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you like it? Termínalo. Estoy bien. Yo no puedo. Demasiado para mí. I usually fast in the mornings. Today I'm overdoing it. We never throw away food. Never. Let's finish never. it. Mm. You know, what I teach my kids is there's always people hungry. Yes. So you never throw away food. Exactly. Mm. Increíble. <laughs> the best. Have a try. Sopa de leche. 25. All right. 25 quarter for that, so like roughly 80 cents. It's yeah, a good deal. Yeah. It's a good deal. Yeah. It's filling. Bebidas. Okay. El cacao. Así empieza. Basically, mashed cacao, right? And then over here is polvo. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yes, yeah, it's, it's cacao powder, right? Amazing. So, cinnamon, rice, and cacao. That's it. But this one has water. That's why it's like a mash, right? It's thick. Puedo. Okay. Maíz. It's puro. Mmm. Yeah, you taste the maíz, right? So, lots of corn here. Mmm, but so chocolatey. Whoa. This is perfect to mix with your with your coffee, no? Como mezcla eso con café, un poco de leche. Tiene un poco. Agarra, agarra. El maíz. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like powder. I mean, there's no point, right? You gotta mix this. Buenísimo. Semilla de jícaro. Lo que te venía contando, ¿te acuerdas? Sí, sí. I guess I have to try it. Ay, ni puedo. Ay. Está rico, pero este mejor. Seguro. The chocolate is better. Cacao. Cacao all day. Esa es una libra. Sí. Vamos a ir a ver food. More food, more food, more food. La chicha. Esta es la chicha de maíz rojo. So it's chicha de maíz rojo. So red corn. Wow, mira todas las piñatas. Está lleno. Look at the piñatas. Me llevo estos. Mira, mira, me llevo estos de Captain America y Spider-Man. Queso ahumado, queso fresco, cuajadita con chile ahumado. Sí, sí, por favor. Wow. Cheese. Cheese. You're awesome. We have to try it. ¿Lo probamos? Sí, sí, sí. Ok, listo. Mmm. Your thick white cheese. Mm -hmm. Eso es ahumado. Ahumado, perdón. Ahumado. Ahumado. As I was saying, it's smoky. The reason it's smoky is because they literally put these blocks of cheese on grills. Look at this. You can see it's like a little chart outside. Very nice. Delicioso. Hay más. Tienes algo diferente. Todo lo mismo. Todo. Sí. Hay este queso fresco. Queso fresco ahí. Esto es no. Esto es un pan, ¿no? No, es una con cheese. It's cheese. It's like cheese, sí. This is cheese. Like cheese. cheese. But it's different. It's called cuajada. Yeah. All right, guys, I'm trying this block of cheese, or a little ball of cheese, actually, but it has chili in it. Mmm. 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 Smoky. Spicy. This one's actually a little more crumbly. Chile, demasiado. No, este no. Está rico. Mmm. I feel it now. Like, aquí lo siento. <laughs> Eso sí es bueno. ¿Cuánto vale ese? Cinco cuartos. Cinco. Cinco. Me dio veinte. Okay. <laughs> so it's tamal. It's made out of corn. Tortilla. Ah, so lo vas a meter ahí. So we got the cheese balls with chili. We're gonna add it into the tamal and into the tortilla. Okay. All right. So you have to break up the cheese, break up the tamal, right? And then you grab the cheese tamal. Así, ¿no? Good appetite. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. Nice. Two different textures and flavors. Mm -hmm. Más, ¿no? Ok. Es como un taquito. Un taquito de queso. De cuajada. Cuajada con queso. Y después, una y otra. Mejor este. Mejor este. Okay. 
My friends, this is amazing. I love this cheese. I like the tortilla more, but we already finished it, so I'm gonna finish this one. Mmm, mmm. Taste the egg in this. Nice corn, super dense tamale. I was just corrected. There's no egg in here, but it has a little bit of the flavor of egg, right? But so it's just water and corn, you know, compressed. But the cheese is the winner. <laughs> cheese with chili, so good. No, gracias, gracias. Muy amable. <laughs> Guys, come to this guy, try his cheeses. They are absolutely phenomenal. Ena Lucia. Ena Lucia. Ah, si? Me lo abres. Right here we have a breakfast vendor. So they have eggs, they have maduros, they have gallo pinto, que mas tienen. So they have cabbage and then a few different like stews here. So they have like chicken, they have beef. It looks phenomenal. I'm gonna pass here because I ate a lot already. But I think we should have try something like this later, right? Why not? Some gallo pinto for breakfast, for sure, with some eggs. ¿Qué son? So it's more like a snack, this one. It's like a snack. He only in Leon made it. Mmm. Mmm. You put a chili, and it's good. You drink like, a beer or drink a cacao. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have it. It's like a corn chip. Yeah, exactly. Mmm. Crunchy. Very nice. Mm hmm Yeah, I like it. It's very easy to eat. Mm -hmm. You know, you can fill it with something if you want. Mm hmm It's good. Yeah. Mm. Only in Leon. Only in Leon, I guess. Yeah. Wow. I love it. See? I'd have a whole bag. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> so now we're getting to the meat section. Over here we have mm -hmm. so many things. Mm -hmm. Wow, what do we got? Look at that, chicharron. Is it chicharron? Eh, chicharron. Chicharron. Frito de cerdo. Okay. Y este es moronga, la morcilla. That's morcilla? Yeah. It's like morcilla, pero nica. I'm gonna try that. Yeah, you have that's to. Like a, that's like a steak morcilla. Exactly. Look, exactly. look at this, how big it is. <laughs> the moronga costs 20, so roughly 80 cents. We're getting the moronga. See, it's solo la moronga. It's solo la moronga. Wow, so I'm gonna try the moronga. This is like a huge sausage. Oh, it's duro. Wow, so you can see the rice in here. So it's just very little rice, more bread, and obviously blood. Delicioso. Mmm. It's like a blood bread. Wow. And it's too good. I have to have more. I have to. I'm a big blood sausage guy. Argentina. Bueno, Argentina también, no? <laughs> Spain. But... Sí, sí. Mm -hmm. España, Argentina. Se come mucho de esto. Mmm. Pero but eso es muy diferente. Nica is the best. I'll tell you, I've never seen it like this. It's almost like a steak, right? Oh my gosh. It's too good. It's dense. Lots of bread. But the blood, the flavor in there. So good. Amigo, mira, Lionel, Lionel. No, pena nada. Gracias, gracias. And now we're getting into the butcher section. Oh, I'm melting here, but it's all good. Butchers, butchers. Y pescado. La foto de pescado. Y de ti? <laughs> She's awesome. Amazing. So we have some fish here. We have red snapper. No sé qué más tenemos. Tenemos una variedad de pescados. Catfish right here. This is catfish. Buenísimo. ¿Cómo estás? ¿Todo bien? You know what I love about this market? How friendly everybody is. Everybody's happy. Everybody's happy. <laughs> Literally, everybody's happy. They're like, come, bing. Toma foto, ningún problema. No pasa nada. Come on. So nice. And this lady, the butcher here, is amazing. So she's cutting up uh, basically all vaca beef, right? Yeah. Beef. So it's cow. It's and then across from us, we have the fish. And then over here, we just have more fruits you and have, vegetables, yeah. right? Yeah. That way? Okay, let's go that way. And so if you want some live crab, here we got it. Right here. Basically for the restaurants, right? Y la casas. You take it home, make a nice crab stew or something, crab curry. Curry crab, like in Trinidad. Bao. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I remember. So what's bao? ¿Qué es bao? Bao is a traditional dish Nicaraguense and prepared with this meat, salty meat. And you put in a bowl, you put yuca, cassava, and other vegetable, and 
It's amazing dish. And we're gonna try that in Masaya. In Masaya, yes. In Masaya, perfect. So Masaya, we're gonna go to tomorrow or yeah. something. I think so. <laughs> yeah, tomorrow, tomorrow, my yeah. friend. Wow, mas. Hola, buenas. Yeah, los riñones. Los riñones. Made it out of the market, and we have more of the market, right? So over here we have just vegetables. The whole thing's vegetables. Yeah. On that side we have a lot of clothing. Compramos algo, allá. Segunda etapa del mercado, the second area, and you can buy clothes, shorts, gorra, whatever you want, my friend. And this is not secondhand clothes. This is all brand new, so they have a mix of things, right? Yeah. And then over here, if you want, you can get the Nicaragua, the baseball team of Nicaragua. So that's like their official sport, right? Yeah. But I'm going with soccer. No, not soccer. Football. Football. Baseball. No, no. Baseball. No, para mí no. Baseball is too boring for me. <laughs> so, ¿qué es esto? De más que más hije. De la maría. So, it's, it's like pink, but it, it is actually yellow corn, right? Oh. Use color for this little Oh, it's delicious. <laughs> it's like sweet cream. Yeah. Como crema, ¿no? Es como otro crema. flan. Es como un flan, pero corn flan. No. <laughs> Delicioso. It's so good. Wow. And the difference, mira que este es suave, este es soft. Sí, suave. Uh -huh. like that's okay. Es más como un líquido, ¿no? Es como un pastel. Ya. Yeah. Like ¿Quieres probar? Ponga la mano. ¿Ah, sí? Uh, caliente. <laughs> so this one's more liquidy, right? It's a little hot. Mmm, it's like so creamy. Creamy, creamy, yeah. Uh -huh. Lots of sweetness here. Wow, so the difference, that one's more like a thicker cake. This one is more like a pudding. Like a pudding. Like a pudding. Oh, you have to try it. Ah, sí? También otro, va a probar. Okay. No, no me quema, no me quema. Ooh. All right, so this one is with pineapple and corn. Look at this. Mil veces mejor. Te gustó más. So good. Wash your hands before you do that. <laughs> so we just exited the market, and where are we going next? Ah, we're going to the fabric of uh, sopa de leche, y vamos a ir a ver perreque. Perreque. Do you wanna see? Let's go. Yes, go. I have no friend. idea what this is, but I'm excited. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go, go. <laughs> After a 20 minute walk, we're here at Cosa del Horno Doña Adilia. Adilia, yes, from Leon. From Leon. Do you want to see Cosa de Horno? <laughs> let's go, let's go. This <laughs> smells good. Buenas. Hola, ¿qué tal? Se ve increíble todo esto. Huele bien. This place is basically a bakery, right? 65 years in business. So here they have uh, quesadillas, quesadillas sopa, de leche. sopa de leche, empanadas, pan de arroz, perereque. perereque, and we're trying pan de arroz. Oh, wow. The five things they got, the samplers, right? Yeah. Okay, so we'll start off with this one, right? Okay, okay, la quesadilla. La quesadilla, se lo rompemos. Okay, rompe. All right, so I'm going to break it in half. Mira esto. Pero no es quesadilla, es quesadilla, ¿no? Es diferente a las otras quesadillas. So it's pan and maize. Mm -hmm. That's all, huh? Mm -hmm. So good. Mm -hmm. So this is cornbread. The outer layer, a little buttery. Cheese. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And it actually tastes like pan de queso. Mm -hmm. It's pan de queso. Probably later. Mm. But with corn. But with corn. Oh, it's phenomenal. Mm -hmm. mm. Whoa. This is so good. The first thing requires. Uh, pan de arroz. Pan de arroz. Vale. Un pedazo. Mm -hmm. Okay. Esto es sin queso. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Tiene como un crunchy layer afuera, mm -hmm. ¿no? Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Golden brown. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amazing cornbread. Mm -hmm. Wow. Increíble este. Mm -hmm. Delicioso. I think it's so good. Over here, you know, the sopa de leche. Sopa de leche. All okay, right, so this one we're gonna use spoons. Sopa de leche. Sopa de leche. Yeah. So I had this earlier. Mm -hmm. It's too good. 
Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. It is amazing. <laughs> wow. I can't stop with this one. It is too good. Texture of flan. Mm. Like a the flan. corn. But it's corn and milk. Yeah, it's corn milk. Mm -hmm. I can eat this all day. Mm -hmm. I mean, definitely my diet won't permit it though. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm baking because the oven is literally right there. It's so hot in here. Yeah, very hot. Very hot. And over here we have la empanada. La empanada. So I'm gonna break it in half. So it's cheese, but the cheese is like, like crumbly throughout, right? Mm -hmm. It's not like oozing out. Corn too? Mm -hmm. With mm. cheese? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So very similar to this one. Yeah. Just more in the empanada shape. Mm -hmm. mm. Wow. A little bit salty. Mm -hmm. A little salty. Mm -hmm. You have the cheese in there, but again, another like really nice cornbread. Wow, everything corn. Solo falta una cosa, no? Perreque. Think of the ultimate cornbread. That's what yeah. it is, right? Yeah. Un pedacito. Mmm. Mmm. Nice and sweet. Fluffy. Mmm. <laughs> Muy rico. Is this like a cake? Mm -hmm. and like a flan. Like a flan, like a cake. Y esto con un poco de miel? Mm -hmm. Oh, sí, divino. Amiga, gracias. Muy amable. Como no, a ustedes, gracias. A la próxima. Ciao, gracias. By the way, it's not 65 years old. That's an old banner. It's 105 years old. Incredible, wow. Such delicious cornbread. Delicious, super delicious. Like too good. Super sweet. All right, one more place, one more place. Donde vamos? Enchiladitas leonesa. Mas, okay, let's go. All right, so we made it here into like a back alley for an enchilada factory. Enchilada factory, but they're saying it's a little late at the moment. It's almost 11, they might be closed. Oh, we might be able to try some enchiladas. Ah, ahí están. Pero que una empezaste hoy? So they started at three in the morning making these enchiladas. So we had this earlier. So they're like chips, right? Like corn chips. Yeah. Puedo. En esta cazuela es donde se. Ah, en esa cazuela. Sí. Aquí es donde se fríe con aceite. Okay. Ahí en el juego y después se sacan y se escurren aquí en el canasto, pues para que escurre el aceite. Ve. So how does this work? Well, it's very simple, right? They get the corn dough, they get over here, they flatten it with an iron, okay? They flatten it right here like that. Then from here, it goes into the frying pan. They fry like a hundred of them at a time. Then from there, it goes over there to this area where they drain it. So they drain the oil from the enchilada, right? And then we have it. So they do this between three in the morning and six in the morning, and around seven, all the vendors come and buy from them. So they buy from them, take it to the streets, and they resell, right? So this is the factory. And that's basically the day, right? So we saw the Central Market, which was amazing. The people there are incredible. We tried so many delicious things. I mean, that is an experience on its own. You have to come to Leon and go to that market seven in the morning, best time when it starts to wake up. You really get the whole experience, people coming in, bringing all the fruits, vegetables, clothing, food, etc. What an experience, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. I'll see you in the next travel food adventure in Nagarote. Let's go. What's up guys, David Hoffman here from David's Bin here coming at you from the beautiful town of Nagarote in Nicaragua. This town is famous for quesillo. What is quesillo? Basically, it's like mozzarella in string cheese form. You can have it on a plate, you can have it in a bag. I'm super excited. I'm here my boy. Hey, I'm happy with you in this adventure. We are in Nagarote, a little town. So we're going to Quesillo Sacasia. Do you want to taste? <laughs> yeah, so we're going to this restaurant. They're going to show us how they make quesillo. And right now we're in the center of town. It's usually so clean. It's full of tuk-tuks, right? Kids are getting out of the school right now. Very nice place. Hey, guys. ¿Cómo están? ¿Todo bien? No podemos. No viene nadie. All right, guys. So we're going to jump in one of these. Not tuk-tuks. This is like a, a bike with an engine, basically. It's like a little carriage. Yeah. <laughs> we're looking for one. We're looking for one. Yeah. Oh, they're nice. They're cool. Yeah. 
So many tuk-tuks. This is like the town of tuk-tuks. Tuk-tuks in everywhere. Tuk-tuks in Nicaragua is called caponeras. 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 Okay, yes. okay. Yeah, tuk-tuk. Yeah. So it's tuk-tuk, it's rickshaw, uh -huh. caponeras. Caponera, exactly. In Nicaragua, it's popular. Caponera in, in town like this. Yeah, yeah, small towns. You move, yeah. You yeah, it's easier. Fast. Dale, dale. ¿Qué tal? ¿Todo bien? Todo bien, tranquilo. So, ¿cuánto vale esto? 20. 20 cordos. So, it's 20 each, so like, it's going to be like a dollar 20. Dollar 20 for both, for both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you excited? Yes, sir. Listo. Tu nombre, amigo? Mario. Mario. This is awesome. That's awesome, yeah. Mario Martinez, amazing. Ma he's our Mario. Driver. Ah, yeah, this is awesome. So he's actually on a motorcycle, and uh -huh. they add this piece in the front. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, we almost hit the bicycle there. <laughs> so the tuk tuks cannot go on the main highway. They have to get permission from the cops. Luckily, because they know I'm here filming, the cops are behind us, and they let us go in. Because there's a lot of accidents happening, obviously. Too many tuk tuks, too many cars too many trucks, just they, they don't allow it, right? They have to stay inside the town. And then the restaurant's over here somewhere. Yeah. Wow, look at this. Que si yo. Que si yo. Let's que do si it. My friend. Gracias, amigo. Okay. Muy amable, muy amable. Hasta luego. Que si yo las acacias y nagarote town. Come on. All right, let's go inside. Que si yo acacias. So they have different styles, right? They have que si yo sencillos, doble rondon, triple, Trenza. I mean, it's a big mix, right? So the triple doubles all, all the way back there. All right, so we're going to the back to see how they make the quesillo. Oh, it's exciting. This is going to be amazing. Hola, amiga, ¿cómo están? Mira esas tortillas. Wow. As soon as I walked into this kitchen, you can see two ladies making tortillas. So corn tortillas. So here she has a dough. She's, you know, mashing it. Eventually, she makes it into this very small block. And then she flattens it, makes it extremely flat, throws it on this little griddle, right? And they're like puffing up, right? Really, really quick. It takes like two, three minutes and it's done. But we're here to see the quesillo. So let's go there. Hola, amiga. Perfecto, entramos. Hola. Buenas, ¿cómo están? ¿Todo bien? Wow, mira el queso. Look at that beautiful cheese. It's like mozzarella. Mmm, caliente, no? Sí. So right here, she's doing la trenza. Wow, perfecto. Y está caliente, no? Sí. Calientito. So now she's gonna make it like a ball. Como una pelotita, ¿no? I know. No, it's, it's, not, it's not a ball. It's flat. It's just round. This is truly amazing, guys. She's flattening the cheese. This one is super, super thin. Oh, it's still super hot. And this one is like a trenza, right? So trenza, which is la cola, right? So basically the hair, right? Trenza, la trenza. Español. <laughs> Se ve increíble. ¿Puedo comerme uno de esos? Así? Yeah. Así? Sí, claro, pues se puede. Ok. ¿Cuál? ¿Este? Sí. Así, ah, just eat a whole gob of cheese. Oh, my God. Mm. Not too salty. I mean, it's identical to mozzarella. So, this is cow milk. Oh, it's so good. It's so hot. Delicioso. Muy demasiado. Mmm. Oh, I'm going to fill up in cheese. Lots of cheese here in Nagarote. Mas, mas. <laughs> so the way we're going to eat this is there's two ways, right? You can eat it in a bag or on a plate. It's cebolla, so onions. Then we have cream. ¿Y qué más? Cream and tortillas. And tortillas, right? So those are the four main things. So all that together, it's going to be amazing. I can't wait. I mean, eating it like this, like just literally hot right out of her hands. Nothing like it, so good. It literally just fell apart in my mouth. Ah, the smell, the smell. Como todo ese queso. Wow. Straight up cheese orgasm. <laughs> <laughs> Perdón, pero es, esto es lo máximo aquí. 
Sí, no, me encanta esto. Es que cuando ves el proceso, la comida es mil veces mejor, ¿no? Como comerlo en la calle, ok, pero cuando ves todo, lo hicieron con, con amor, ¿no? Me encanta cómo hacen las trenzas. Sí, sí, la trenza. Sí, hágame otra trenza, otra trencita. Es linda. Vamos a ver. Esta es trenza. Here we go, here we go. Así, así. Yeah, she just stretches it out. Makes it stringy. Little ponytail. Amazing. Mira eso. Esto va a ser rico. Muy rico. So, as you can see here, the trenzas have sort of become like more like blobby, right? If you have to, you have to put it into the fridge, right? In la frijola. So you have to put it in the fridge for it to like stay like this beautiful shape. If not, it becomes more like that, which is fine. You're still gonna eat it, right? <laughs> Guys, look at this. It literally just stretching out. You stretch the whole thing like un queso delicioso que ta, se está derritiendo, ¿no? Como mira eso. Wow. I can't wait. Amiga, gracias. Muy amable. Okay, vamos. Vamos a comer. Gracias, amigo. Gracias. I love it here. It's amazing. That cheese is... Por aquí? Sí. Okay. Acá es el tiste que, que prepara acá ella. ¿eh? Tiene tiste, tiene cacao, tiene semilla de jícaro también, que es muy típico, ¿me entendés? De la zona. Y lo que son los otros productos, como son refrescos naturales, tamarindo, es chía, ves, con tamarindo también, ves, que es melón con naranja, todo eso se, se despacha, ¿ves? Y lo que son refrescos, ¿ves? Y después seguimos acá con lo que son las cuajadas ahumadas. Frito, de cerdo. So we're like in the ordering area. So that was the kitchen. This is where people order. So the restaurants right there, they order here and then they build the quesillos, right? So para nosotros vamos a tener dos quesillos, ¿no? Uno de sopa, que okay, digo en bolsa, y uno regular. Para enseñar a la gente cómo es la bolsa, because the bolsa is really, really traditional, right? In a bag. El típico es el de la bolsa. Y hoy en día, pues, lo comen mucho en platos también. Pero muchos les gusta mucho más en bolsa, por lo que vos sabés que se come, pues, la cremita. Because in bolsa, it just starts to melt in there and everything just gets mixed. Oh, I can't wait. Este, ahorita voy a preparar un quesillo doble. Doble. Sí. So, que son doble tortilla? Doble tortilla, doble queso. Ah, wow. Increíble. So, this is a double cheese. ¿Y qué metiste ahí? ¿Qué era eso? Cebolla. Solo cebolla. Cebolla eh, conservada en vinagre. Y ahora crema. Fruta y su crema. Ya lleva su punto de sal. Le ponemos un poco más para que no quede simple. Another double. So, two tortillas, two pieces of cheese. Got some salt. Then she adds the onions, the very end cream. It's done. Igualmente lleva dos tortillas. Okay. Lleva la misma, se puede decir similar al doble. Next up we're getting a regular double, right? So that's a cheese that's not trenza, it's just little flattened cheese like that. Oh yeah, it's like a pancake of cheese. You gotta add some salt. Then she adds the onions. At the end, she adds beautiful cream. Gracias, amiga. A la orden. Oh, guys, I'm excited for this. This is going to be a bomb of cheese. It's going to be so good. Oh, my gosh. So I'm going with the regular double. He's going with the trenza, right? La trenza. La trenza. Y el tuyo es? El doble. El doble. 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 It's a double. <laughs> it's not doubles like Trinidad. It's just doubles. Double cheese, double tortilla. Oh, I cannot wait. Vamos. Vamos. Oh, yes. Yeah, look at that, all the cream, the onions, the tortilla, and the tortilla is like soaked in this cream. Quesillo frunado. Mmm. That was amazing. Mmm. Love, love this. Oh my gosh. The tortilla with the cream, the cheese. The cheese is like literally just starting to melt here. Wow. Increíble. Mm -hmm. It's so good. I mean, double cheese, double tortilla. Mm -hmm. mm. I love the onions. Mm. The onions are amazing. Look at this. Are fresh. Mm -hmm. The cream are very fresh and tortillas. Y si quieres, puede ser así? Mm -hmm. Con yeah. la mano. Of course. Of course. Dude, let's go in here. Wait, wait. Oh, you're going to put in. that in? Sure. Mira esto. Ponlo ahí, ponlo ahí. Okay. Ahí abrida. Mm. Rico. Mm -hmm. I personally would do it with the hands. <laughs> Mucho más fácil. Sí. Sí. Mm. Oh my gosh. So good.
so amazing. I mean, it's literally just corn and cheese with mm -hmm. onions and cream, but the combination is fantastic. The combination with the cream, mm -hmm. and tortillas, and the cheese. Mm. It is insane. I love it. But I'm not presenting. Okay. Yeah, right there. Look at that. Wow. More. Yeah, bro. More and more. More. <laughs> it's not so hot. Tiste. You take quesillo. If you don't drink tiste, you are in nothing, man. Okay. Mm. Mm. It's corn. He has drink corn. Okay. With a cacao. So refreshing. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> so good. Yeah, I love this. It's traditional, right? With cassava. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> what an experience. Nagarote. Mm. Esto es the ultimate. By the way, Nagarote is in between Managua mm -hmm. and Leon. Mm -hmm. Literally like halfway mark, right? Mm -hmm. It's a custom for Nika people when going to Leon. Mm -hmm. First, stop it and on the street for eat quesillos. It's very popular. Yeah, you have to. Yeah. I mean, this is unreal. Mm -hmm. Unreal. And this one is going like this, right? You get everything on top. I see. Mm -hmm. It's like a cheese taco. Double. Double, yes. Double taco. Double taco. Con quesillo. Esto es. Okay. Como un bucket list item for anybody mm -hmm. coming to Nicaragua. <laughs> si, si, you come to Nicaragua and you don't eat quesillo, mm. forget it. Mm. I mean, it is a meal. So filling, so good. <laughs> es que estoy enamorado de esto. Del quesillo. Esto es. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm not like, you know, I, I like cheese, mm -hmm. but I won't eat it every day. Mm -hmm. But tortilla. Oh, dude, I can eat with everything now. Mmm. Mmm. La crema, no? Si. Best thing at the end, you just gotta like, literally try to soak up all these onions, right? Mm -hmm. Hey, look at this the cheese. Let's go like this. When I come back to Nicaragua, I'm coming here no matter what. If I'm not going to Leon, I'm still gonna come out here. Because mm -hmm. this is... Of course. <laughs> it's incredible. First Nagarote, after Leon. You know the best part about this? Mm -hmm. That if you're going from Managua to Leon, mm -hmm. you stop here. On the way back, you stop here again. Yeah, <laughs> many people do it. <laughs> mm. Mm. It's huge though, huge. Get the double and then get the bag to go, no? Mm -hmm. I'm getting the bag. I gotta try the bag. <laughs> <laughs> the bag's the best. Wow. Es que es demasiado bueno. Mm. Mm. Loving the tiste. Corn and cacao. And it's like an ice, an ice chocolate with some grains of corn in there. Like, you know, like almost like diced up. So refreshing. You must try this. Trenza de Gurla. Si, trenza. All right, so I got another one. I got the trenza in bolsa. This is the way to do it. Real traditional way. Okay. Mm. Sal, no? Mm hmm it's Amazing. So this is how they do it, right? So whenever yeah. you come here, if you just want to come, grab it, and go, this is how you mm -hmm. get it, right? In bag. They serve everything in bags. Tacos, yeah. etc. Same thing, right? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Amazing. Mm. Oh, I love it. And you have all the coming out? <laughs> mm. But when you have in the middle quesillo, mm -hmm. you, uh -huh, you so, use the back. So you do like this, right? Uh huh. So lo tengo así. So it like literally Open absorbs it. it. Sí. Yeah. Y ahora, ¿cómo se abre? Okay. Hay que tener cuidado. Sí. So now, now it's like soaked. Mm -hmm. So it's the same as this, but just in bag. <gasps> mm -hmm. okay. It's pouring out. Look, look at this. 
I well. have to do this. Malolo. Okay, yes. So okay. Put my hands. Put my hands. Like okay. so. And. Okay. Here. I mean, they overdid it with the cream. <laughs> Demasiado crema. Let's see. Oh my God. No, you can't. You can't. Experience. Yeah. Entonces. Eso es todo. Like, like that? <laughs> Alright guys, so this is how you do it, right? Mm -hmm. You flip it over, oh, then exactly. you make a little hole. Un huequito. Un huequito. Y... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Literally everything's coming out you of it. You are Nika now. Now I'm Nika. This is amazing. <laughs> mm. I really don't know how you're going to eat the tortilla. Yeah, no, you have to. Mm. You have to like really get in there. You have to like have to open bite. a bigger hole. You have to bite. Si como un hueco más grande, no, no, no. No? Yeah. Bite. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Record. Oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Everything's coming out. Oh, yeah. The cheese, the tia. Mmm, the cream. <laughs> bite and cut. Bite and cut. Oh, did the best. Have it this way. This is not have it. Uh -huh. I'd rather take it in the car and just eat. Yeah. No? Y en bus también, ¿no? Yeah, sí, en bus. Um, Increíble, amiga. Increíble. <laughs> Esto es lo máximo. Sí. Pasaste la prueba de ser nica. Mm -hmm. You're nica now. <laughs> sí, sí, sí. Mm. And that's basically it, right? <laughs> we saw the process of how they make the cheese, the tortillas. Mm -hmm. We put it all together. So I had a double. You had the trenza, the and then trenza. and then I had the trenza here. Yeah, the, the trenza. trenza is here. Yeah, the trenza. The yeah, yeah. Ah, okay. Yeah, of course. Nice. Yeah, it's, it's a little thicker, right? Because it's 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 round. It's like, well, thicker in a okay, way. Yeah, the other one is very thin. Thin. And I love this. That the ah uh, tiste. Tiste. Corn with cacao, ice, so refreshing. You know, Nicaragua is very hot. Mm hmm. So now you know. Mm -hmm. If you're ever in Nicaragua and you're going to Leon from Managua, yeah. you have to stop in this town. Nagarote. Y las acacias. So stop at this restaurant. It's the one we recommend. It's one of the best. Right here you have, you know, dining hall. You uh -huh. order it right in front. You can see them put it together. You sit down. Literally you can order it in two minutes and you eat really quick. Hey. Okay. I'm Nika now. <laughs> yeah, Nika. My friend is Nika. Mm -hmm. I'm happy for this. Mm -hmm. Because only Nika eat in the back in the seals. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna use that home. Throw everything in the bag. <laughs> You know, I'm going quick with this. <laughs> I'm so tired right now. It was hot today. Yeah, very hot. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Subscribe to my channel for more awesome travel content. I'll see you in the next travel food adventure in Nicaragua. We're going to Granada.